Hello everyone, um, this week I'm going to do a project on um, stone balancing uh, and natural sculpture. Um, the artist Andy Goldsworthy um, has done loads of things um, and is well known for his land art um, using um, things like stones, leaves, um, petals and sticks and making, making natural sculptures and then taking photographs of them so I thought it would be a good project to do this week. Um, and I've got so many stones that I've collected <laughs> over the years. Some of them are found in my garden, so um, just things like that I'm sure a lot of you have got. Um, so one of the first things I'm going to say is um, you need a quite a flat surface or something. I've got this um, stump, this tree stump, and it's got quite a nice texture to it, so it should be able to and grip some of the stones but it's quite flat as well <clears throat> so first of all I'm going to try and pile them up one on top of the other so I'm using quite a flat stone but it's got some texture to it there okay so the aim is to see how many you can pile one on top of the other <laughs> And I like this. I, I always do it when I go to the seaside um, when you can lose yourself and it's quite meditative. Uh, trying to find the centre of gravity. So those first few ones are pretty easy but as, as uh, you carry on it becomes harder. <laughs> so this is the fun bit. Okay. Right. To readjust them there, right? I'm going to change. So, if I'm using both of your hands, it's making micro adjustments, she says. Hey. There, I put another one. Hmm, yes, go on. So, what have I got? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Wow, oh, yes. Huh. Maybe one more. Can you see that? Ooh. One more. Wow! 